What's up? This is Tactic Talisman, and this is just going to be a quick tutorial um, covering the user interface. If you're looking for the starting tutorial agents, that'll be in the next video, and I'll put a link for that in the description and in the video here. And so I just wanted to show you real quick a couple things about the user interfa interface because the user interface for EVE is one of the, it, it makes the learning curve uh, what it is. So the first thing I want to show you is the captain's quarters button and how you can switch between ship view and captain cor the captain's quarters, the, the walking in stations view. If you look on the right hand side of your screen here, you're going to see these three blue arrows and it says enters captain's quarters if you're in the ship viewing mode or if you're in the captain or yeah if you're in the captain's quarters or the walking in stations it'll say enter ship hangar so that's just a real quick how you toggle back and forth between those um, I usually keep mine on the ship hangar because it loads faster and it's a little bit easier to see what ship some people like um, this this walking in stations mode you know what that's cool I um, I just like it to load quick and I don't usually um, use it that much um, you can check it out if you want so that's the first thing I wanted to show you the next thing is the neocom which is going to be the left hand side of your screen here and that's all these buttons and this can be manipulated you can move um, things around over here. If you right click, uh, you can lock it. You can turn auto hide on so that it will hide. It slides off the side of the screen. Um, you can disable the little blink notifications. I usually do that because I can't stand those things blinking. Okay, the third thing that I wanted to show you is resizing your windows. All the windows can be resized in the game so you'll notice this one started pretty big and you can just you can grab the edges and I I like to get mine really big I like to see everything in the window I open it up and like to see um, what's going on so I'll I'll resize those windows so they're pretty um, big like that and you can see everything going on and I I personally just tag them up on the left hand corner there and then I'll just drag, open them up, like so. And that just gives you a real good view. Um, some of these menus can can get uh, pretty extensive. The notable is the market window here. The market window has a lot of information, and when it's, and when it's cramped in the corner, you can't see a lot. So resizing the windows is another thing. Um, the next thing I wanted to show you is just minimizing. If you double click at the top of a menu, it it snaps it, it minimizes it up. You just double click it again and it opens it up. It's a quick way to have windows open, but not necessarily using them. If you don't want to use the buttons on the sides um, or the hotkeys, you can just see, you notice that's how my my chat menu is down here. Open it up close it. Same thing with these. The last thing that I wanted to show you is just kind of stacking or, or nesting um, some of the different tabs. So I'll just resize this up and if I bring it up, hover it over, see how it turns gray on the top of that menu. I'll let go and it'll just lock in. It'll snap to the same size and then both of those menus are open. They're just tabbed in there. That's how I usually I will I will nest, you know, or snap in all of my menus into the same um, big tab for uh, usability. If I close those. Say I open up assets, opens up, and then if I open up the market, it's just going to lock right in there, and those will stay stay in there. So that's just a quick. Um, overview I just wanted to show you you can resize anything um, in your your overview and that just kind of helps you kind of orient things starting out all the menus are super small and you can't see anything 
So make sure you resize. See, so resize all your all your menus so you can get a better view of what's going on. You're not cramped in this little tight spot trying to scroll through a thousand things with an inch and a half of viewing space. So next video, we're going to be doing the starting tutorial agents and we'll do um, four of those, walk through those. So check those out and we'll catch you later.